Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back everybody. So, I know it's been a while since I uploaded and everything. It's just I needed to take a break. And I've had a lot going on and everything, you know, with Christmas and everything. So, we're going to get back to work on this build here. Now, I do have some bad news about this build. So, a lot of the clips that I had from like a week ago, everything got deleted. So, I lost all those clips. So whenever we start working on it and stuff, there's going to be some missing clips and it's going to kind of jump around, but it's still going to show a lot of the building and everything. I was trying to get this done before New Year's so we can have it done in the tour video, but I don't really think that's going to happen because there's a lot left to go in this build. So really we're just going to get as much done as we can. It's just a lot to go. The main problem is, is quartz and stuff is kind of slow to get because we're just trading for quartz. And it just takes forever to get the quartz and everything. Let's go ahead and jump into this time lapse and see how much we can get done. So from that time lapse, that's basically everything that we're doing this week. It really didn't look like a lot, but it actually was because this place is really big and it does take a lot of work definitely getting all these quartz and everything. So I'm going to go ahead and tour you guys around a little bit and show you everything that we did get done. So we added in more these trader guys because we needed a lot more redstone. So we went ahead and added these guys so we can trade for redstone. 
if we fly up here, I can show you all four corners. So all four corners right now is just going this little plaza thing like this. Eventually we'll get in here, dig out underneath this, and then add rooms in all four corners. We'll add in different things like a super smelter, a brewing station, and stuff like that. I don't know about the other two corners. So far I know we want a brewing station and a super smelter. So if you have any ideas on what else we should put in the other two, then let me know. We're going to have a villager trader and stuff out there. And take this one down. This one right here is just temporary. We're going to have a bigger one out there. As for the four sides, they're all complete except for this one right here. And Eddie's working on that right now. He's trying to get more quartz and stuff so he can finish it. As you can see. So this should be done by the tour video. Also with this farm, we will have water all the way around just like we did that side there but on all the sides just to make it look a lot cleaner. We want it to make it look like it's floating. And then inside here, we was going to add water, but then we decided to do a landscape in here. You know, add like a path, walkway, trees, and stuff like that. Just make it look a lot better. So that's what we're going to do here eventually. We want to get all the court stuff done first. As for the bottom area down here, so down here it's all built up and all finished except for behind. So behind there, I haven't did all the redstone work for all the shocker loaders yet. Just because I didn't have enough redstone, that's what I'm still farming redstone out there for. So as soon as we get that, we can go ahead and add in all these shocker loaders. For now, I just put the boxes. So this is how it's going to look whenever it's completely finished. Besides for like walkways, whenever we do add those. Now, we haven't really been running into too much lag because that is one of the big concerns about doing the item sort of this big. I don't know if it's because most of the items aren't in the item frames yet, or if it's because all these chests right now are empty and we don't have a bunch of loot over here, so it's not loading as much. So hopefully whenever we do finish all that, it won't get too laggy and we can actually use this place. So that's pretty much it on the item sorter. This is kind of just a short video, a short update on everything. I also want to talk about the plans and stuff going forward with 2021 and stuff. So sometime the first week after New Year's, I will be releasing a full tour video. Now this is gonna be a full tour video of everything, so it's gonna walk through everything. It's gonna be a long video, so it is gonna take me a little bit to edit, but that should be coming out sometime soon. And then after that, what I wanna do is I wanna start streaming again. For everyone that was here before knows I used to stream four times a week. So I do want to start doing that again where I stream Monday through Thursday again starting after New Year's. I'll probably start it like within the first week. So whenever I do get back into the streams, we'll probably end up finishing this build here. This will probably be the first thing that we work on stream is finishing up this right here. And then I got some other projects and then we'll switch to our main project for next year, which will be the dragon build. I want a whole custom landscape and everything. So let's go ahead and fly over there real quick. Just gotta wait for everything to load in. So as for the dragon, nothing's changed over here really because I haven't been working on this. I've been mainly focusing on the item sorter over there. I mean, I came over here and cleared out some more trees up on that mountain and stuff because we needed a lot more wood. So I cleared out some trees and stuff, but that's really all I've messed with over here. So coming up after New Year's, after the item sorter is done, this right here is going to be our main project. And some ideas I have with this, you know, I want the whole custom landscape and I want to do a big build around it and stuff like that. So this build here is going to take a lot of work and it's going to be a lot. So we are mainly going to be focused on this, which it should turn out really good if it comes out even close to what I'm thinking. It should look awesome, so I'm excited about doing that. So that's pretty much it for this one. I know it's kind of short. It's mainly because I lost a lot of clips that I did have and everything that I was going to put into this episode. So I kind of just pieced together what I had and what I could to put this episode up. Which mainly I wanted to go over some of the stuff that we're doing in the future. Like yes, I will be streaming it again. Yes, the tour video is coming soon. So stay tuned for that. And a lot of new stuff coming for next year. So I'm going to go ahead and end it off here. I hope to see y'all at some of the streams and stuff whenever I do stream. And yeah guys, have a good one. Peace out.